and yes, welcome, hello and everyone, and welcome back to Crownfalls, a funeral metropolis at this point. <laughs> so the attractiveness is really down um, at the bottom, but I'm not too worried about that because we still, oh, well, from now on with the investors that we have reached in the last episode, which is just beautiful, um, we now have a lot of additional options to improve attractiveness. And I'm still pretty confident that we can reach the attractiveness cap again now Battle also very important our very first battle cruiser is out there out on the ocean and is now helping us defeating the princess and in this case here we also have now yeah another problem though and this problem is still our windows and our glasses i've already built a few more sand mines so we have the sand rolling in as we can see the window makers though are not making anything right now because the glasses are missing for that i do have my glasses or my glass maker down here i could still push this one yes this is possible by another 50 percent or what i can also do is up here i think there we have the glass makers and we should still be able to push one more here instead of the ornaments i'm sorry ornaments but in that case Productivity is more important. And we also have quite a lot of glass makers that I don't need. I will never need that many. Right? So one more thing that we can do here is I'm going to get rid of those guys here. And instead of those four, I'm going to have yet another glass making industry. So those guys here. Uh, four of them just fitting in once again. Let's build all of them. Beautiful. There they are. Um, they are powered already. So they're producing at 200%. The only thing that we really still need is more glass Fire. or more Left sand, ruins. sorry, Behind. more sand. And that is what we can do here. Let's get rid of the fishermen. We don't need that many of them anymore. And Your instead, I will just have a few more sand mines that we can take care of them. right -o. One thing, though, that I do need to do is I need to upgrade a few more farmers. We have quite a lot of farmers here in Sleepy Hollow. Ah, uh, in Sleepy Hollow, I say in crown falls so let's upgrade them to lazy workers and there we Our have them broke out. this gives me a bit of a well a balanced workforce there once again and the sand mines are working for us now hopefully fixing the glass problem the window problem that we have there right now with our first investors now we also have gotten rid of any influence problem that we had so far so that means we can also now really spam more ships and i just love spamming Please ships and I would like to take this opportunity of riches and greatness with the investors of actually doing for the first time in quite some time, doing some quests again. We haven't done this in quite some time. I gotta say that. Um, we have a few things here. And the first thing is the immersion test. There was a time actually when 14,000 coin was a lot of money. And I actually waited on that. But we have old Nate here in Crown Falls, in Sunken Treasures, in... Cape Trelawney and you have acquired a diving bell from old Nate. There is no way to know if the creaky prototype will hold up until you try it. Righto. So let's deliver some 14,000 credits to him. I don't know if we have to click on him and that's it. Let's try. There he is. Hurry, I guess I'll have to get a ship lady. over there because I certainly cannot store 14,000 coin in a ship. Abandoned. So we're just going to get this um, over there and while my ship is on the way um, I've also done something else, having the members club now here in the center, where we need it for our investors, which are pretty unhappy right now. That's because the members club is missing. Right. -o. So the members club, once this is in, um, the gold watches, the pocket watches might be something that we can still do. Now, let's just check this up real quick, because this is one of the more important productions that we need. And lo and behold, it does need, once again, glass. <sighs> I hate it. I hate that we need so much glass. It's actually like steel. Steel and glass is insane. Um, we do need the goldsmith as well. And for that, we do need gold. Now, gold, we don't have in Crown Falls, but we rather have it in the New World. And let's just check it real quick where exactly we would have some gold. In Drumtown, we have it. In Playa del Carmen, we actually have six gold deposits, which would be our next target then. There it is. It just needs actually quite a lot of Roberos. Brings me back to Playa del Carmen. As we can see, the population is here. Um, they want something though. They want a boxing arena. Let's build them a boxing arena. Also, we need more bricks again. 
And this is just my mistake again. Shipping we don't have any bricks reporting. anywhere. I do have Your clay deposits in the new world, attack. but they require a huge amount of workforce. And that is something that I don't want to spend in the new world where we have a very, very limited Who amount of space. So I will take there. yet oh, another cargo down. ship and Leash get about 400 tons of bricks over there so we can... Um, fix this for good and old nate offers you a diving bell fine with the fourteen thousand, don't forget that so we have now purchased that and we should be getting a diving bell did he just throw it in the ocean for me no there it is my scavenger buckthorn too and with this we have finally unlocked the scavenging we actually need to do the first attack. scavenging ourselves, or well, we do need always to do it ourselves, but we need to do the first scavenging as a test. So let's just get over there. There we have something to scavenge, and if you don't know that yet, with scavenging we can get items up to epic and legendary rarity um, for zoos, museums, and stuff like that, even for our trade union. So it's a very, very useful way of getting somewhere, and just look at my balance. 40,000 at the moment. I'm really happy about that. We found some scraps. Um, we can deliver those scraps now to old Nate. So with those scraps, we can also craft us the items, right? Um, might be something we can also do. Um, let's, while my scrapper is back on the way, let's actually just go to Eli. Because once with the investors, I also want to show you something cool. And that is that we have now unlocked the legendary and epic um, town hall items. The They're quite That's expensive overall, behind. but we have the money and we might just purchase a few interesting things here to boost under our sexy economy. And yes, there is also a lot of yet. mobbing because this is the only way of actually saying it. It's pure mobbing at this point. Steal how everybody attack. hates us, except for Hugo. And he, even he has Ship given up attack. on a few things there. I guess. Now, my hunting cabin or hunting cabins are working, so the fur is coming in. There should be no problem anymore. And let's give me the Ship next quest. Let's attack. deliver that. Join up the scraggins. Not half bad, and not half bad. Eh? I can turn around your junk so long as I get to keep the odd smidge of gym crackery. And tired of coming back up with nothing but scrap, I can point you to the good stuff for reasonable fee. Righto, so we actually get some coordinates now, and we need to pay for that. Ship under attack. And let's just see, dive at old Nate's coordinates somewhere down here. There's actually a ship waiting for us. Ship what are you doing? Attack. Target place. There's actually someone waiting for us. I have no idea who that Ship is. Oh, there attack. are quite a lot of ships waiting for us. What is going on here? Back in Crown Folds, we do have some windows again. So what I really would like to do is build the members club, right? So it's just about 10 tons of windows waiting now. Five tons on now, or five tons. We also have now the next mission there. So our scrapper has arrived, but something is happening out there. I am Vasco Oliveira. I conduct the solemn and discreet business of none other than King Juao of Akaroa. That's La Corona to the place. Ah, La Corona, I know this we one. We come only to pay our respects beside the grave of a once great empire. It's obvious why they're here. It's the same reason we're here. For the emblematic power that scepter will give whoever owns it. But we can't afford a war with La Corona. Feeble though they may be. So I'm afraid you'll have to rely on wits to beat this Olivira to it. Olivira, he's called. He looks like the Admiral to me. He put on a different haircut and it's Olivera from La Corona. Alright, oh, you are trying to mix it up again, you defectors. Let's decline this one. And yeah, there we have now a new quest. It seems like we have quite a bigger quest than we first thought. Alright, what we need to do actually here is we need to dive once again. Let's go down there and see what those ships actually wanted here. Right, so there it is, the big blue. 
And oh, we found this something. Is the journal of my Nadaski's journal. Nadaski. And we need to deliver this one to the queen. The city is now it is unreadable to at the moment. So let's just get it to the this queen. Log is in a to my warehouse. Did you not bring any art restorers with you? And yes, we need to restore it. This is our first you task here. Right, so you've recovered Nadaski's journal, but its pages are barely readable. Exposing the fragile pages to a long sea journey would be too risky. Instead, you must make room for art restorers at Crown Falls. And that is what we need to do in Crown Falls. While the ship is on its way with the journal, hopefully safely so. I mean, perhaps we should put some protection on it in the future. This time it will be fine, I guess. We might actually send this battle cruiser here right to it. Perhaps it's making it on time because there is another ship of Princess Ching on the way. Let's actually move over there. There I've got... Oh, there's Olivera again. Vasco, he's called. So he's now digging somewhere else in the ocean. Pretty interesting. So we do have another adversary. And let's get to the harbor now. Very good. I think we should be safe. And it's also pretty cool to say that we are actually capped on beer. I don't know when this ever happened, but we are totally capped on it. Um, amongst other things, we still have the problem with the rum, though. That is an endless, an endless battle. In every Anno game, it's a battle fighting for the rum. Even though so many ships on it, we'll need to put another ship on it. And Kingfisher sounds about right to me. Let's just go there real quick. And, oh yeah, leaves. this one's been damaged. And I think they're once the again epidemic. too close Friends to each other. They are. Right? So they're, over time, Attention, getting too close to each other, which is just horrible. And let's also move my ships up here. And I think we'll still need a bit more rum production. Do we, though? No, I don't think so. Still waiting for it to Sugar arrive. cane is missing, even though some of them are full. Storeroom's full, boss. From what I can see, full output storage. Yeah, we need more warehouses here too. Let's place a few more warehouses there. It seems like it's a bit congested. This is also my mistake here of not having enough bricks, which we need. And my ships are now up there. But still, the whole rum problem is endless, I think. I think I've never seen it other than being a problem. Now, we still had something else to do, right? We wanted to send the bricks, quite a lot of them. Let's make it 300 bricks. Let's make it 400 bricks. Um, and perhaps some steel beam and some weapons to reinforce us in the new world. And send all of this to the new world to the western frontier, which is rather close to the map. So I don't have Ship to worry about this attack. too long. Right, so with this we will be able to defend or to build up more defense in the new world and basically build our production up there with all the bricks that are coming now over there as well. My second battle cruiser is finished, so we have now two. And we have also delivered now the Nadaskis Journal. You Let's put so this much. one in. We're lucky there there's I even a faint again. possibility of returning this drill to a semblance of its original condition. We must first see to the binding. People tell me a flour-based glue will be gentler. So we do need to deliver quite a lot of flour. Six tons of flour and two tons of sewing machine. We have that, so we can turn it in right away. One is no dunce-hatted imbecile, but I rather think we'll need a class swat or two to decipher this. A university with a budding college of paleography. Right, oh, next up we should get a university so that we can restore it further by more professional people. Fortunately for us, we do have everything for the university. Sale to art restorers and collect your reward. There it is. Look at that. They're hiding behind this beautiful building there. Collect my reward. Let's click have on you it. Succeeded in your mission? Oh, it's all much clearer and now. we do get Nadaski's journal incomplete, but it's at least years. readable now. So, what do we need to do? Exactly, we Ship need to read it. New orders. And there it is. So, so it's basically telling us about the journey of La Corona's fleet and how it's chasing the scepter. So, it wants this artifact where it's all about. And another one of my ships was destroyed just there. Let's get my next battle cruiser out there. Very good. And in this regard, we have the next quest now. The Eve of War. So the first few pages of the journal are a first-hand account of the naval battle at Trelawney. 
It's evident Nadaski didn't think much of the king's strategy. The log also hints at the compass bearings at which you may find the scepter. So the scepter is the first thing that we need to find about it. This well, part of the artifact, and find the locations. So the guard, dogs, the smuggler cove, and the watchtower. It's a bit of a riddle there. So off we go. Buckthorn to the salvager and to battle cruisers following me now. Fortunately, it is marked on the map. So that we got our first location here, just beside this watchtower. I gotta say, it looks fantastic. As we can see, those beautiful structures emerge. So this is on the way now and making good progress. So so this is now going in the background, of course. We don't need to worry about that too much anymore. The other ship is now on the way for the gold, so the pocket watches. And yeah, my windows are also coming in plentiful now. Um, so that means I will be able to do something Bye. with that. But wait a second, we still have the trade route that uses windows um, beside all the other stuff, right? And it's just taking away way too much so I'm going to take oh, the windows the out of it of building our material transportation right we lack the oh and we also lack coal now which was another resource um, that we have injury quite plenty of we do have some rights now too like the it's, it's, it's all like coming together at once most of the time wait a second are all my coal mines under right yes they are so this has probably something to do with having a high we can't production rate on it. Let's get rid of the sailmaker there. I don't need so many sailmakers anymore anyway. Right, let's get rid of those. And instead of that, let's build some additional police stations. An explosion in one of your factories. And a sink mine is exploded. It's all coming together at once. Let's build the sink mine again. Emerge to sweep your city. And yes, we do need more police presence. Let's actually use the mobile task force for the first time. So in this regard, there it is. It's also a modded building and it's just looking beautiful, right? Fantastic what the modders can do with this game. Under there we got it. It's on the way now. Of course, the, the jolly police officer being trained now and then um, take care of the right tiers. One of them and this is actually fine. There we have Your something else. Let's also have a... Another one, another one of these things coming, and this is Miss Hunt who's taking my back, my strictness, which is fine. Attention, it is not a big deal. I don't care about this at all. What I would care about though is my Tarek. More than ready. So what I should be doing, as a matter of precaution, I'm moving some of my weapons the things we love, and steal up us. here to Tarek. Right, so here I can fortify this island even more. Because Tarek is important because of the um, red pepper. This one here is not important. Not anymore. At least now that we have Com Prefecture, which is just um, our main source of fur income. Now we do have all the resources in Tarek to fortify our town even more. And thank you, we also have enough um, influence, right, to build it. So there we got the cannons. Um, I think we might actually place another one out here then as well. So those guys are now here. And as we can see, we can build all of New them. Orders. How very nice and how very convenient to further optimize my island there. Down here, also all the um, hunting you. cabins are working now. So this is quite New a lot. Orders. Let's just see how much furs, 200 tons of furs, the cargo trader can now take with him every time, which is just powerful. And after about, I think, 100,000 hours, my soap trader got destroyed by Your Miss Hunt. Because Miss Hunt thought to herself that from now on she's also going to be a player again. Especially Hi. against Princess Jing, she's building up her fleet. Um, my Orpheus has arrived in the new world with the materials that we need to defend our islands now, right? So I want to build some uh, proper island defense up here in the western front here now. We're going to do this the same way here in Maribu, where we only have some guns at the moment. And in Playa del Carmen, where we have a beautiful... Um, festival going on not anymore but we had one and here I would like to have not more harbor defenses because we have that but boxing arenas and this is where I need the bricks for right oh the ship is coming in let's just also check real quick on crown falls down once again I think we can now dive there it is let's dive for once 
and just see how it goes. What we might find. Perhaps a scepter. Perhaps a piece of dirt. And the scepter. How very good. Actually, the first try. This is but a portion of the rod. It's just a portion of it. So it's only a piece of it and we need to it's most no likely construct it again. It's no great secret then. We are both looking for among the Holy Scepter of Capone, things. among other things. So deliver that to the Ark Restorers. Let's get this one up there. So what we're doing here right now is, by the way, following the main storyline of Cape Trelawney, which is culminating in a nice battle scene. About La Corona. Alright, and the newspaper guy. I have all the influence in the world now. I don't need to care about it anymore one bit. So we just go with the maximum of influence. Spending. And we still have 227 left over. Oh, look at that. Someone else also wants this island there now. It's Miss Hunt. But as I said, I don't care about these islands. Some of them I've taken to destroy them or to weaken the enemy. Um, but I don't need to keep them all. Even though you now, influence-wise, it wouldn't be the, the, the biggest problem oh, anymore. The, the Western Frontier, we have the materials. Let's Your unload it. Is under attack. Let's unload all of that and build us Harbor some nice um, cannon towers. Hours. There it is. Actually costs quite a lot, as we can see. We don't even have the timber for it. I'm surprised at it. There we got the first one. I do need to get me some timber here as well. Night embraces you, and let's also take some... 40 tons of weapons with us as we make our way, we make way for something better. to drum tout, I guess, because there we still have something to build. Up here as well in Dowry. Let's get to Playa del Carmen. Deliver some of those bricks. We have a lot of timber here looking around. And I will at some point, of course, also have a trade rod here that just well, distributes well, the building the materials, like in Cape Trelawney. Oh, I'm very... So far so good. More battleships are coming out. The next one I can commission now. And we have the windows finally to also build us the members club to increase the happiness of the investors. And look at the balance. It's also going up now thanks to it because this was a bit of happiness boost there. Um, this is a terrible color though. Perhaps some bluish color would be amazing. There it is for our members club. So my investors can now go to secret places. Stay tuned.